What are you guys doing? Going to church. Going to church. Bye. Bye. Good morning, Seekers. I'm glad you found us today. It's Sunday. It's Father's Day. We're all tired after yesterday's crazy recital, right, Eloise? So tired. And I like hurt everywhere. I was just telling Ronnie about last night I couldn't even sleep because how bad my legs hurt. Right, Ronnie? It's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, we survived. It was actually pretty fun. Um, it was great to be able to have a recital. I can't wait until next weekend we get to watch it. I don't know how much I'll be able to share with you guys though because I couldn't record it and I don't know if those kids are gonna let me have a copy of it. So we'll do the best we can. Obviously I'm not gonna be able to record just the movie theater screen and show it to you. That would be weird, so. I don't know what's gonna happen, but guess what we're doing? I'm gonna show you guys what we're doing. What are you guys doing? Going to church. Going to church, what? We are going to church for the first time in like three and a half months. It's going to be super short. We can only go every other week for 45 minutes. It's just going to be basically one um, talk and pass the sacrament. And we have to wear masks. And because it's in our um, like sacred church area, I'm not allowed to film it or show you guys. You've seen what we do at church because we've showed you so you already know the you already know how it goes, but now we're gonna be able to do it in our church building. We can't stop and chat or anything. We just have to in, sit far away from each other, take the sacrament, watch, listen, and book it out. So wish us luck. It's coming. Let's go. Oh, Jasper, wrong door, honey. Do you remember? It's this door. See how they have it open already? Oh, he's going without us. Oh my goodness, we better hurry. Wait for us, buddy. Wait for us. That's okay. That one can be, oh yeah, it does have a pointy side. Oh yeah. Finn's already in there and Oliver's already in there. Good job, Jasper. And here's Dad on Father's Day. Why don't I ask the church? What do you guys think? Was it crazy? We still have costumes. Was it weird? Yeah, a little bit, but yeah. What did you think was weird, Eloise? Uh, all, of all of it. <laughs> I thought it was pretty cool. It was. There were 30 people, 30, including my whole family, which is like a lot. One third. <laughs> well, that's one third. It's right. Good point. There would only be 20 if we didn't come. That's homeschool math. For Day. Homeschool math for the day. So there were 30 people only, including the bishop and our whole family. So yeah. we did sing. Um, we kept our masks on when we sang, and that was hard. But I was impressed with only 30 people in the room how good we all sounded, right? Am I right? We sounded good. Yeah. It was like I had my little choir back. It was weird. I noticed there were several people of different parts. And the bishop is one of them, and um, Lynn in front of me, and me, and the bishop's wife, and this, the sister who leads the music is also in my choir, and the sister who was playing the piano is also my pianist for the choir, so it was almost like a choir reunion. Everybody's like, they don't care about that. Yeah, this pretty much was the entire choir there. Yeah, it was, pretty, it was pretty cool. I mean, there were members of my choir that weren't there, but it was... I was thinking, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm going to be the only person singing and no one's going to be able to hear anybody but me, but everyone was singing. Um, the message was short and sweet and to the point. 
wasn't really about Father's Day. It was more about dealing with the trouble that we've been going through. Um, every single person there was wearing a mask. Thank you to my ward family. I was really worried there would be people that were there refusing to wear one. And we were nowhere near each other anyway. And we sat in the back and they kept the, wind, the, the doors open um, on either side of the building and there was a breeze going through. So I felt very, very safe. And I felt like everybody was safe from us because we were by the breeze with all of our children. We were the only ones there that had little children. So like, oh, that was the worst part. Trying to keep them quiet. Every little noise you could hear. Every time Jasper's giggling, I was looking over at him like, with my mask on, you know. You can't tell how mad I am at you, but be quiet. I was like, all right, Jasper, you did really well, buddy. Yeah. All right, well. <sighs> What? He's like, give me more credit. Give me more credit. He is only four. Good and we boy. did have a long day yesterday. And I could sing, even though I had no voice last night. So. All right, we're gonna go head home. We're gonna have a barbecue. And what else are we doing? We're doing fajitas. Oh, we're doing, well, yeah, but we're having people over. Yeah. Dave's mom's coming over. Hey, Ollie and Finney. Something like that. Oh, there's Ollie and Finney. They did a good job with the sacrament. <laughs> oh my goodness, I was just getting ready for bed and it's like almost midnight and I realized we never recorded anything tonight. We had the kids over, we've been just talking and laughing and I just didn't think about it. I'm so sorry. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what it was like to go back to church in the middle of a pandemic and I'm sure we'll see you again very soon. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and seek your truth. Bye, seekers. Find us later. Bye.